The human brain is one of nature's most complex structures, and scientists are still a long way from understanding its mechanics. But, a new study has come one step closer, to unlocking its secrets by unraveling its immense complexity. The research has revealed that the mind is home to shapes and structures, that have as many as 11 dimensions. And understanding these structures, could help us to reveal exactly how memories are formed. The research used in-depth computer modeling, to understand how brain cells organize themselves to carry out complex tasks. We found a world that we had never imagined, said neuroscientist Henry Markram, director of Blue Brain Project in Lausanne, Switzerland. There are tens of millions of these objects even in a small speck of the brain, up through seven dimensions. In some networks, we even found structures with up to 11 dimensions. The complex geometric shapes form when a group of brain cells, known as neurons, merge to make what scientists call a click. Every neuron connects to its neighbor in a specific way to form an object with complex interconnections. The more neurons that join in with the click, the more dimensions are added to the object. Shapes that are three-dimensional have height, width and depth, like any object in the real world. The objects discovered in this study don't exist in more than three dimensions in the real world, but the mathematics used to describe them can have five, six, seven or even eleven dimensions. Outside of physics, high-dimensional spaces are frequently used to describe complex data structures or conditions of systems. For instance, the state of a dynamical system in state space, Professor Cees van Leeuwen, from KU, Leuven, Belgium, told Wired. The space is simply the union of all the degrees of freedom the system has, and its state describes the values these degrees of freedom are actually assuming. The researchers used a type of maths, called algebraic topology, to model the whereabouts of these structures inside a virtual brain created using software. To test their model, the researchers then carried out experiments on real brain tissue. They found that the virtual brain, could be stimulated to form structures with progressively higher dimensions. In between these structures were multifaceted cavities. The appearance of high dimensional cavities, when the brain is processing information means that the neurons in the network react to stimuli in an extremely organized manner, said Ran Levi from Aberdeen University. It is as if the brain reacts to a stimulus, by building then raising a tower of multi-dimensional blocks, starting with rods 1D, then planks 2D, then cubes 3D, and then more complex geometries with 4D, 5D, etc. The progression of activity through the brain resembles a multi-dimensional sand castle that materializes out of the sand and then disintegrates. The big question the researchers are asking now, is whether the intricacy of tasks we can perform, depends on the complexity of the multi-dimensional sand castles the brain can build. Neuroscience has also been struggling to find where the brain stores its memories. They may be hiding in high-dimensional cavities, Professor Mark Cram said.